Welcome back to the channel, guys. So, spring's back, winter came and left. So we're gonna throw around this limited edition Nico Leech. Uh, as you can see, chartreuse. We're gonna see if it works, if it doesn't work, and what happens. So, let's see what the Susquehanna has. Let's see if we can find a big one. All right, so here's the Leech. <clears throat> Again, I haven't thrown this. I just got this in the mail today. I do know they're limited edition and they still are all they still are on Nico's website. So if you get on there, use code VIN10, save you 10%. I got it on the one eighth ounce sled by North Branch Tackle. And this color is definitely bold. Bright. But the water has some stain to it because like I said it did snow. We had, I don't know, an inch or two here, and then it melted, so everything's a little high, but as you can see, this leech is definitely going to stand out. And I know smallies like chartreuse. I know it's definitely a color that they key in on, because I use some jig heads that have chartreuse, and they get bit, so definitely doesn't scare them. I feel like this would be a good bed bait, too because you can see it well. I also got some... Oh, stuck. Oh, man. All right, so here's the leeches. <clears throat> I got chartreuse. I also got fusion. And then we got some obsidian pelgrimites. Different videos, different times. Here's... I actually just snapped off, so that's why I'm showing you this now. I have to retie. So here's the sled I'm going to use from North Branch Tackle. Show you how I rig it on here. So what I do is I just go, I don't know, maybe an eighth of an inch down, about like that. And then I pull it up over the sled weight to keep it up. And the great thing about Nika is, is the elastic, it's not going to rip it. And just line up your hook where you want it to come out pop it in there boom done so that's how i'm rigging it that's what we're going to use all right retied and ready to go but yeah, there's a log right in here every once in a while i hit it and i think it's a fish biting when i send the old hook set and probably Definitely about 30 bucks on that log in there. We're gonna try the boat ramp here. Why not? Plus this concrete's gonna hold some heat from the sun. It might bring some fish in. Hopefully we can at least find one in the river today. If not, we might have to hit up the creek. There we go. That's a good one. Oh man. Right here at the rock. That shocked me. There we go. Oh. Well, that answers that. Nico Leech and Chartreuse. Look at that. That's a success right there. There you go. That's a nice one. I do have my scale this time. I did buy one finally. Well, I had one and it died in the winter time and got water in it and everything else. Let's just get a quick weight on this one. Uh, three even. Three on the dot. I don't know if you can see that. It's a nice, healthy, smally. It's so hard to see how big these are, understand the size and health of these smallies in the photos. So got this scale to try to <clears throat> basically just show it better document it better for you guys so this is a little bit off but we're gonna get a quick let's curl your tail back down so he's coming about 17 quick my shot let him go. 
Let them grow. Nice. But yeah, like I was saying, they hold up there in rocks just to get warm. So anytime you're fishing by some rocks, cast up in there. All right, left the river. I came here to Penn's Creek. Yeah, give the old chartreuse leech a try here. Look at that. Barely had it in the water for two seconds. Jeez. Jeez. Freaking hammer. Oh. that other stud on the, the Nico leech man the chartreuse chartreuse definitely works I mean, that's nice a good one and with the release nice well that didn't take long here so just keep casting but when I first got this leech and I saw the chartreuse I was like man I don't know it's pretty bold like color like fish even gonna eat that clearly they do maybe that's why they eat it because it's so different but i mean i've only been out for a little bit two nice smallies and god just let it speak for itself but leave it in the comments below if you think chartreuse is a fish catching color or if you try to stay clear of it just curious because as you can see in the water, I mean, clear water, it's not natural, but just curious what you guys think. All right, shout out to you, John, if you're watching this video, because I know this is your spot. But just hold on while I catch a big one real quick. It up. I thought it was stuck on a rock. Nice. Man. Another hammer. Spring bite. Can't beat it. I'll tell you that. There we go. Another good one. A good healthy pass creek smolly. Yeah, when he had it, see, I thought it was stuck on a rock. I just lifted it up, and then I felt him pull back. That's awesome. Jeez, see that the water? What the heck? Holy crap! I thought I had a backlash. Jeez, literally the next guy. All right, bud. Go. Yeah, as soon as it hit the water, he picked it right up. What a little, little chunky guy. Well, as they say, if they're biting, we're gonna keep fishing. Let's be real. Even if they weren't biting, we'd still be fishing. Again, I'll leave. The links in the description of where you can pick these up at. Also, where you can get the sleds from, too. There we go. That was a big fall fish. A giant freaking fall fish. Holy crap. Well, catches creek chubs too. Giant ones. Goodness. It's definitely one of the biggest creek chubs I've ever caught right there. 
That was huge. Well, knock that off the will it catch that list. Another one. This is the smallie. Don't get in the barrel. Don't jump on the barrel either. Nice. Fish after fish after fish. Another good one. Nice good fat smallie there. Push this way so you can see it in the sun. There we go. Right by that barrel. I want to go and eat dinner, but this is crazy. I love catching fish after fish after fish good ones too and these are nice smallies i think i'm gonna invest in a kayak too do some kayak fishing you know i like bank fishing don't get me wrong but oh, oh that one came off he smacked that thing so hard i was thinking about floating down the creek in a kayak Bang, he hit it. <laughs> but yeah, I think I'm gonna invest in a kayak this year. Do some kayak fishing just to get off the bank every once in a while. Change the scenery a little bit. And also with the kayak too, I'd like to get in some river tournaments, some local river tournaments. That'd be pretty cool. Something different, something to try. So for all you kayak fishermen out there, if any of you could give me any ideas of companies to look into or who to stay away from, et cetera, et cetera, that'd be great. Just because I'm new to it, never owned a kayak. I'm going to end the video here, but thank you so much for watching. Thank you for the support. So if you want to pick up these leeches, like I said, I'll leave. Well, I'm going to end the video here, but thank you for watching. Thank you so much for the support. And just click that like, please subscribe, please leave a comment. It just helps get these videos out for other people to watch. But if you like these leeches and you want to pick some up while they're there, I said I'll leave a link in the description. Again, use code VIN10, save 10%. But I'll see you guys soon. And again, thank you so much.